What's up everyone, Willie Apple here, and just yesterday, Apple has released WatchOS 9 Beta 5 to developers, and hopefully later today, they'll release it to public beta testers. In this video, I'll be showing you what is new in WatchOS 9 Beta 5. Alright, the first thing is, if we were to scroll up and ping our phone like this, we have a new sound for when we ping our iPhone with our Apple Watch, and it sounds really nice in my opinion. When updating your Apple Watch, you get this new splash screen right here. This splash screen just shows you s some new information about the Apple Watch that was already there. Alright, something new, if we were to press and hold the power button, Emergency SOS has now been called Emergency Call. So if you need to do it, all you gotta do is swipe or continue holding the power button. We seem to have gotten a lot of resolved issues with WatchOS 9. So some of the new watch faces here were really buggy. Older Apple Watches, for example. My, I did not experience any myself, but... I hear the playtime watch face has been fixed, so if we had issues with the playtime watch face, sometimes it would just act really buggy, but now it's not as buggy as before, and it's a lot better. Workouts have dramatically improved, so um, if we were to go to a run right here, we could see that things load a lot faster in the workout app. A lot less buggy, especially the running part where they added a lot of stuff. I use this pretty much on a daily basis. It's nice to see that the running workouts have been fixed. And now when it comes to phone calling, the call UI was really buggy and that has now been fixed. The portrait watch face is broken. So if I were to try setting this as my, I would go to create watch face usually, and then I would choose the portrait watch face. But as you can see, it completely freezes up, you can't go back or anything, and there's like no way to set the portrait's watch face. It's broken and you can't even do it on here as well, and even in the watch app, you can't do it as well. Hopefully this gets fixed in beta 6, because I kind of want to match my Craig Federighi with my Apple Watch right here. Now what can we expect next from Apple? So I say today we're going to get the public beta, hopefully in 30 minutes as of recording this video. I say the next beta for developers is going to come out on the 16th, hopefully before school starts. School for me starts on the 17th, so uploads will be a little bit slower, especially with the betas. Thanks for watching this quick video about WatchOS 9 Beta 5. Hope you guys enjoyed. Comment, like, and subscribe. Share it with your friends. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!